Back down, they block. The 60 goes around. Briscoe hard into the wall. And the window net coming down. He sees the flames coming out in the engine and Briscoe. Yeah, his window's net down. He's getting out. Chase. Climbing out quickly yeah, as the safety crew gets to him. You knew it could continue. There's no way you can race three wide that aggressively without somebody losing control. He hit that wall kind of at a at an opening where the rescue personnel come out onto the racetrack. And now that he's out of the car, he'll sit down. Seen a lot of big hits today. After a restart, everybody's very aggressive. Contact with the 9 and the 20 in front of Briscoe and just got into that curvature of the wall, the, in, the inside wall. Yeah, this is going to show you just how hard this impact was. Mm. Oh. Something the tracks have to continue to look at. How do we? How can we get those curves out of the walls? You want to be able to have access for personnel, safety personnel, to quickly get to the drivers. But you can see that access point creates a bad point of impact. Safer barrier doing a great job, but it's just that angle of impact that's so bad. And think about that: all four tires once again off the ground on this. Well, about 3,500 pound race car. And so Chase Briscoe, who was running in the seventh position, part of this, that hard hit brings out the caution for the seventh time today. And we'll set up yet another restart. There's absolutely nothing he could have done differently there. Oh, gosh. Thankfully, the safer barriers were there to absorb some of that hit. But this is, once again, will remind you, such a dangerous sport. And we, we, you get accustomed to how fast the cars are going. And you, you, you almost become immune to it. But, you know, you're going right there. You're probably going 170 miles an hour, 175 miles an hour. And it's just huge impacts. And that angle of the impact is where the problem's caused. Again, a hard hit here for Chase Briscoe. He quickly was able to get the window net down. The fire on the engine, and he jumped out of that car, and now he will head to the infield care center. <laughs> 